this is part 11 of angular 14 series so in this session we will discuss about the logout functionality along with the storage click to visual studio code and now if i open the browser you know the login page now let's log in it okay now uh, i can see here uh, on the menu uh, no, options is there you know, profile and logout so on clicking on on a logout you know this page uh, will call one service you know to destroy the current you know session token and then next step is to remove the you know token from this browser memory as well and then you know system will redirect to the login page that functionality i'm going to implement so let's you know clear all the things and now go to the login page again okay now flip to visual studio code and here open that you know dashboard component html and here you can see that logout you know button is there now let me attach click event and here log out on you know custom method which i am actually going to define in that dashboard component ts file here okay and go to the auth service here i can see login and load user so similar also i will write here logout and uh, during this logout i have to call that you know http client dot let me copy it and paste it over here and uh, then options i need to provide so here is the options so this is the option let me as this option actually i'm going to re you know use multiple times so let me consider it with the private private and uh, this is the private variable now let me use this this dot unknown and remove this part and then go and use the same headers here headers and uh, let me return this now go to the component ts file and here i need to call that logout and then need to subscribe and here let's say api response and this api response i'm going to put as any type and then i will write if api response id if that is there if id is greater than zero that means successfully log out and you know, destroy the session now we can you know remove this sorry local storage dot remove item and in this scenario we can check that you know login component ts file where actually we uh, have used that you know, token name my token we need to remove this then need to redirect user to the login page for that we need to inject that router service and this router service basically will redirect dot navigate method and this i will use a you know, redirect user to the you know root path and i can okay let me redirect first now let's save the change and here i can open the console and here if i put a debugger now click logout now i can see api response see logout successfully done and data is coming on id is coming on okay then click continue now you are in the login page okay now if i go to that application tab and here i can see there is no token right now if i come back to the previous page using you know browser previous you know button now i can see again it is coming to the you know login page now refresh and also if i see dashboard if you are in the dashboard so automatically console is throwing an error right so now you know that basic details is not coming as because you are unauthorized now if i see there see unauthorized error is coming now if i check i will show you one scenario let me log in 
b to e at the rate to one okay now i can have this url now just do logout and again try to load the dashboard see page got blanked right so as because that you know unauthorized error is coming actually uh, we don't allow user to you know come back to the dashboard page uh, you know once he logged out so how to achieve that and if you know user do that so system will automatically redirect user to the login page so how to achieve that in my next you know session i will discuss so for that stay tuned and be safe thank you for listening have a great day